What the frick is up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Alright, so it is uh, Tuesday. It's the 23rd. It's February 23rd, and um, we're going to hit lakes today. We're going to hit a massive lake day. Um, no PRs today, but just a lot of reps. Um, we're going to focus on really just exhausting every muscle in my legs, uh, especially quads today, which shouldn't be that hard considering uh, my legs are a little sore from yesterday. I did taekwondo class and uh, we did a lot of kicking. But with that being said, we're on our way to the gym, just uh, down some pre-workout, uh, just got off of work, and uh, we're just gonna go kill this day. But uh, yesterday, I filmed a little bit of posing after the gym. It was my um, arm day. So I'll put that in this video as well. Like I said, I did a two a day yesterday. But I also weighed in, um, and I weighed in at 184 point uh, something. So uh, that's exciting. So hopefully tomorrow, cross our fingers, we'll be that 185. If not, um, you know, at least 184, and then by Thursday for, or uh, sorry, Friday for sure, we'll be 185. So that's exciting stuff. But uh, I'll catch up back with you guys in a minute. All right, guys, so we just pulled up to the gym, and uh, we're just going to kill this freaking workout. I'm pumped. But for those of you who uh, love music as much as I do, um, I have been listening to Falling in Reverse on, like, repeat as my uh, workout music lately. And uh, so if you guys have never heard of them, I would definitely suggest it. But let's get with the workout and I'll see you guys in a little bit after my workout. All right, guys. So uh, we just got done with my killer leg workout. I mean, like, I'm literally dying. <laughs> um, it was crazy. Uh, the gym was pretty packed today. Didn't really get a chance to uh, film posing. So when we go home, oh, it's a little bit blurry fix you guys there all right um so we're gonna go home practice posing as soon as we get home so uh it's kind of a good judge of like my pump in my legs and stuff um because if i wait too long and eat right after it's not really a good judge of like what um my physique is so we're gonna do that real quick and then we're gonna eat and um yeah but the first clip I'm going to put in here is going to be my uh, physique from yesterday. And you'll be able to tell a difference. Um, you might not be able to see my legs as much. But today you'll be able to see them and um, how much crazier a pump is in your legs. Um, you may not realize how crazy it actually is. Um, but in physique, it's not necessarily all about the legs, but if you do have a little bit of legs to show off, it does give you kind of a better um, physique and overall um, thickness, which is really um, important, especially when you're cutting, to keep that thickness and just cutting uh, out the fat and, and making your legs vascular and shredded. Um, now your upper body is a com completely different game just because that's what more of the judges are judging on But uh, yeah, that's just a little tidbit of information for you guys. But with that being said, we're gonna go head home um, I'll show you my physique and then we'll eat uh, I'm really hungry. So and then I'll, I'll when we eat I'll sit down and tell you guys what I did as well. So we'll uh, go home all right, so we're back home and I'm gonna show you my physique. Um, keep in mind, this is right after workout. Um, no uh, supplements after my workout, no nothing, no food. So this is a completely after workout kind of facet uh, physique update, um, unlike yesterday. And then um, we'll get to eating after this. So here we go.
not mandatory. Other side. Really focusing on flexing the quads and the abs. Here's the front shot. Quarter turn to the right. Quarter turn rear. Trying to flex the hamstrings. Quarter turn. Back to front main tour. For fun, to show my calves, we're gonna do a rear double bicep pose, or front double bicep. Uh, I know this isn't a physique um, pose, but uh, it's always good to know all the poses even for like classic or regular bodybuilding. And also, it helps flex those and show off what you have, so. All right, so there's my posing. Hope you guys enjoy. All right guys, so uh, as you can see, we're sitting down and we're gonna eat, crush this meal. So right now, uh, I made a pretty good display of what I'm eating, but we got some broccoli um, with some pink Himalayan salt, um, no butter, just pink Himalayan salt and pepper. We also have a cup of rice um, with some pepper on it. And then we have a huge piece of chicken pot pie. Um, very high in protein, very high in calories and carbs, which is really what I need after a heavy workout like I did today. Um, I'm also going to have a protein smoothie after this. Um, I like to eat that after a big meal, um, kind of calm my stomach down a little bit and also to get an extra protein. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm going to do. So we're going to crush this meal and um, afterwards I'm going to explain what I did uh, during my workout. All right guys, so we just crushed that meal and uh, my workout consisted of a lot of reps. Um, so we started out with just basic stretching. I did two minutes of jump rope to warm up and then I went straight into a workout. So I decided to go ahead and do leg extensions first. Um, just really getting my quads warmed up. I, I had a little um, soreness in my quads, so I just wanted to get that worked out before I went like heavy in anything. So I started with lightweight. I only did one leg, uh, leg extensions at a time. So I did uh, 12, one, 12, the other leg. Um, I did that for three sets. Um, and I went from warm up to 40, um, pounds and then went to uh, I believe 70 pounds uh, was my top set. It's not too incredibly much but enough to like get your quads really loose and um, just feeling that contraction. Then I went ahead and did um, let's see five sets of um, 8 to 15 reps um, of double leg extension 
Um, I consisted of between 125, that was my first set, um, to my last set was a rep of eight, and I believe I did, I did 190 um, as my top set. It just felt really good um, to do eight for 190. Um, but anyway, after that, I went straight into leg curls. Um, I did the laying down one, so the prone one. Um, first set was kind of a warm up set. I did um, 12 reps and then 12 quarter reps. So I went from uh, doing full range and then uh, straight and supersetted that with um, a quarter range. First set, I believe, was 50 pounds. Um, I did. I ended up doing four sets of these, um, and I first set was 50, and then last set I believe was 80. Um, I'm not the strongest with leg curls, and the prone one really challenges you. Um, so I'm getting better though, and I'm getting stronger um, because you know when I first started uh, this kind of thing, especially with I was doing the sitting up one, not the laying down one, and it uh, the laying down one really. Um, challenges me just a little more and honestly it's way better uh, contraction in uh, the hamstring area and your growth is uh, exponentially increased doing the laying down one um, and uh, so that's what I've been doing and it's been working pretty well. Then I went and did uh, squats with the bar um, I did 135, uh, first set of 12, um, and just focusing on that, you know, warm up, uh, 135 on the bar, um, just getting deep, and uh, just trying to get higher reps in. So I did 12 of that, then I put uh, another plate on each side, so I ended up doing uh, 225. Um, now I did that for three full sets, uh, just 225. I didn't go up or I didn't go down. Um, and I just did eight to 12 reps. Um, so as many as I could, uh, I tried not to rest too much in between, but enough to um, you know, catch my breath, maybe stretch a little bit, um, but you know, really just focusing on um, you know, hypertension and uh, you know, really just overworking myself to the point of failure, um, which was all about today, was pushing those limits and not going too heavy, but pushing them enough where you're consistently just exhausted and that last rep is, uh, you know, it is so hard and you gotta push through it mentally. Um, and this is all a mental challenge. Uh, 225 is not that heavy, uh, especially if you're you know, PRs and the 300s, uh, you know, 225 is like nothing. But I'll tell you what, when you do higher reps and you do multiple sets, that it, that will overwork you more than PRing any day of the week. And, uh, you know, that's just my opinion, but I mean, it's scientifically proven and, that, and that's where you get the biggest growth um, is that kind of work. Um, granted, you know, PRing is great, but you know, you don't PR every every week you do legs, you know, maybe uh, You know every m once a month or maybe even twice a month, you know, so uh, It's all about the hypertension and just getting your reps in uh, and then I went down and I went back to a plate and a quarter and then uh, back down to a plate on each side, so 135, and I did 15, so as many as I could, and I went all the way down, um, basically to the point where I, that last one was like, I needed to rack it on the bottom racks, not the top rack, because I was just going till failure. Um, anyways, then I did calf extensions, I did um, regular and then I did outer focusing on the back head of my calves and I did that um, consistently with 135 for uh, a set of 20 um, for each uh, inner and outer calf. So 40 with 135 and then 40 with um, a plate and a quarter on each side. 
Um, so really focusing on the contraction. Then did um, as many as I could lunges. I started with 25 pound dumbbells on each side, um, you know, and then I did 20 of those first set, 20 second set of with a 35 pound dumbbell, and then went to failure, only got uh, 13. Um, and that last one was really hard to push through, but I ended up pushing through, and that was my last set. Um, then I just went and stretched, you know, got a really good stretch in. But that, yeah, that was my workout, and uh, I'll tell you what, it was a killer leg day, and I'm seeing improvements, um, and I'm really happy. Um, like I said, tomorrow is a new day. Um, hopefully, I hit that 185, and as you can see in my posing, I also look a lot better. Um, but with that being said, this is going to be the end of the video. It's early. I got to edit this video, and then I got to go to bed. I, I got to get up early for work. Um, tomorrow but I think I'm gonna try to film tomorrow too it might spill in over to Friday's video as well but be be sure to look uh, for that video as well um, if you're new here thank you guys for watching um, be sure to subscribe share you know comment like whatever um, I really do appreciate it and um, you know I, I love doing this uh, even if it's just for fun um, but with that being said follow your dreams follow your heart follow your passion Peace out. See you guys in the next one.